what I'm about to talk to you about is uh, going to seem rather fantastic, uh, unbelievable, and uh, you're going to at this point say, if you haven't said it before, Doc, you're crazy. Well, let me tell you what's coming. You see, the Homeowners Association right now charges you a particular fee per month, your dues, your assessments, which you send in to your management company. Now, on top of that, there are the additional fines for the weed and the garage and the bike on your and the and the basketball hoop and your cars on the drive. You, you've got those, and you're starting get, to get used to that, aren't you? You're, you're angry about it, you're frustrated about it. Well, what's coming makes that look like nothing, because here's what's going to happen. You see, the division you live in is a private corporation nonprofit. Therefore, because of that, they get to do, that is, your HOA, under the advisement of attorneys, management companies, and collection companies, are going to look for new revenue streams. Let me sidestep for a moment and say, if you want to raise, you need to work harder, you need to stay with the company longer, but you need to continue to produce what you're doing. What if you had a free reign to produce any income that you wanted, like you were a car salesman or a real estate salesman? All right. Well, here's where we're going. Number one, toll roads. Roads into homeowners associations are now going to be turned into toll roads. You paid to live in your home. You come and go as you please. But now a picture is going to be taken every time you come and go. And there's going to be a fee for that. Oh, it'll be a quarter, maybe a dime at the beginning. And you're going to be charged when you leave. A quarter, a dime. You got guests that want to come and visit you? It's a toll road. You're going to have to pay for that. And at the end of the month, those charges and fees are going to be put on to your assessments. But wait, it gets better. You see, you get mail delivery into your association. The mail slots are on the property where you claim to own it. For that mail truck to get into the division, there's going to be a charge. And ultimately, that mail delivery is going to be subcontracted to another contractor who will take it as a handoff and then pass it and deliver it to you. What a wonderful boom to the U.S. mail. What an incredible income to the new industry called the sub-mail delivery service. The same thing is going to be happening and is happening with utilities. Utilities are now being bought from the provider. They're then being sent out to you separately and you're going to get an upcharge on your utilities. Gas, electric, and water. Everything that you do on or around your property is going to turn into a fee. You say, well, I bought into the community and it had a common area park. Yeah, but you're going to have to pay to walk on it. So you want to use the barbecue? Well, that's going to cost you some money. Well, haven't I already paid for that? No, you just paid for the fact that you lived in a community that had one. So it is going to get more and more and more expensive. And my estimate is the length of time for this to take place, the next seven to 10 years before everything is completely locked up. 